making it a mushu pork bowl that scallions, lime, brown pork. So the red cabbage, had to throw those away because I also had to throw the scallions away. Kinda like been two weeks. <laughs> Poison, sweet thai, sweet soy glaze, jasmine rice, and sesame seeds. Then I cut the vegetables in a small part, put 3 4 cup water, a pinch of salt, bring to a boil, and I'm just gonna do maybe like 12 minutes, cause last time it was kinda burnt at low heat, so yeah I'm gonna do 12. Ingredients here, red cabbage, I might cut that up smaller. So I'm taking the pork is boiling, cabbage, I'm gonna cut the fish for like 4 or 6 minutes, probably like 5 minutes. Okay, uh, I drained the grease and cooked them for like 5 minutes. Also, I'm gonna add the ingredients. Scallion cabbage first until tender for 2 or 3 minutes. Cooking for 2 or 3 minutes. I'm gonna stir ah. the sauces and half a teaspoon of sugar. Season. I'm probably not gonna put sugar, but yeah. Well, I added the sauces, but I just cooked my phone with my nasty fingers. I'm gonna mix it up. Made this. I forgot to show you what it was in the pot, but I got the rice underneath, the pork on top. I put the extra soy on top. This is an oh, I forgot. Had a little too much scallion on the side, but that's okay. I like it raw, anyways. And I get Japanese mayo. Mayo on the side. I might just like put some over here. Hello, fresh. It look into the mayo. I think it tasted really good with it, but. I let the professionals think about it. I also put butter on the rice because it said like tablespoon of butter. Try the cabbage. This is the way my dad does it. It's a lot thinner than my grandma. My grandma cut it. So I wish I had cut it because I know how it should have been, but it's okay, whatever. My grandma doesn't like it when I cook. I put the extra sauce so I can mix it in with the rice. I like saucy rice, I don't know why. I should have probably took a scoop and tried it. Yeah, last time I made it was pretty good. Not sure about the butter and the rice. Mmm. Yummy. Yeah, I mean. Because I don't think Asian people usually put butter in their rice. I think that's more of an American thing. That's good. Hello Fresh should definitely look into adding the mayo. I just think it tastes good. And very thin cabbage. If I had cut the cabbage, I would have made it really thin. See if you can see that. Squeeze the lime. Easy to make too. Following the directions really. I ended up cooking the rice for like 15 minutes. Probably. I like forgot about it. So it still got burnt like on the bottom of the pot. I also keep forgetting to put salt. So I put the salt after it's cooked. I don't know, that's the reason why it keeps sticking to the bottom of the pot. All done, good stuff. Super easy to make. Cut vegetables, cook meat, mix the ingredients that are already pre-portioned, make the sauces already pre-portioned, kind of. The sweet soy sauce isn't, but... You don't have to worry about going to the grocery store, looking for all the stuff. It saves you, I don't know, if I had to go to the grocery store and like get all this stuff, it'd probably take me like an hour because I don't shop at groceries. Actually, never mind. Probably like 30 minutes. 10 minutes to find all the ingredients. But like to like pick the ingredients, like all the ground pork, like which ones should I get, like all the different brands and stuff. Probably take me forever. I would just look at the ingredients and like read all the descriptions and stuff. I used to work at a supermarket, so finding the ingredients wouldn't be hard. But yeah, I really like it. <clears throat> this, this is the last time I'll be making this, at least for now, because my grandma canceled the order because she really doesn't like it when I cook. Family problems, but that's okay. 